Good morning, everybody. Uh, we are going to do a studio tour. I'm going to show you where I watch my movies and uh, who knows what else. But first, we're going to take this little guy out potty. So let's go, Levi. There you go, buddy. Make it happen. Okay, so now we are in my studio. This is where I record all my videos. There's the drum dums chair. This is where I take all my notes. And here's my ever-changing background. I do uh, tend to change that background a lot. I don't know, I kind of get bored with things and I don't know, I just like to keep it up to date. And there's my Funko collection that I uh, just started collecting. There's my umbrellas. Yeah, and uh, this is my daughter's room actually, but she is at college, so I use it as my studio. So anyway, let's go into the living room. I'll show you guys where I watch my movies and I'll show you my movie collection. Okay, that is my 47 inch 3D LG TV. I've actually had this for about five years now, uh, pretty much since 2011. I actually did an unboxing for this uh, TV way before I even started my, um, my new YouTube channel. But yeah, I mounted it on the wall. Um, I'm just like that. I don't like seeing wires and all that stuff. Okay, in these little benches over here, I actually keep my old DVDs. And just to give you a sneak peek. Yeah, I, there's some of my old DVDs. Uh, a lot of these I've upgraded to Blu-ray, so I really haven't taken them out. But uh, yeah, as you can see there, there's a Halloween 4 10, limited edition 10. And then there, right behind that is the Halloween 5. You got the Lord of the Rings extended editions. Something definitely worth noting is these. These are the Star Wars limited edition two disc sets. Uh, they include the original theatrical versions of the movies, except the quality is just really bad on those. So I highly recommend getting Harmony's editions. But yeah, I keep most of my DVDs uh, in these little benches, this little coffee table here. It's also filled with uh, DVDs. Let you get a quick look at that. That's all DVDs. It's just filled to the brim. And there is where I keep my Blu-ray player. I know you, it's hard for you guys to see it right now. It's a Sony though. Sony 3D Blu-ray player. This is where I actually do uh, just about all my editing. I sit here on this couch and I just edit away. And that's my uh, Asus ROG computer. Yeah, I really love that computer. I use Adobe Premiere Elements 14, so you have to have a, a decent computer to be able to handle a program that size. Okay, and over here in this armoire is where I keep all my Blu-rays. Open that up and let you guys see it. Yeah, so that is my Blu-ray collection. Um, it's getting pretty big. Um, let me turn on the light so you guys can see it better. But I've already put out a few videos for my collection. I do them by genre, and I've done um, sci-fi, horror, so I still have a few of those collection videos I have to do. But here's all my action. Action's at the top. In the middle, you got your dramas and your sci-fi. And then the bottom, it's all horror. And then there's more horror down here. And my steelbooks are over here too. Yeah, there's my Halloween collection. But yeah, I'm getting close to around 500 Blu-rays right now. And there is my Friday the 13th collection because I'm currently in the process of reviewing all those. I only have two left. And also before I go, I use this. It's a Zoom H1 for my uh, audio. It's an external mic and I always plug my lavalier into that and that's how I get pretty decent sound. I'm always on the quest for better uh, better sound, so I think I'm sticking with this though. And as you guys know, I'm a drummer, and you can actually hook this up to an electronic drum kit and record the output, which is nice. So I'm planning on doing a video down the line to show you guys how to do that. So anyway guys, that is my studio tour, home theater tour, Blu-ray tour video. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and drum them out.